So guys, in this tutorial, you will learn how to generate all sorts of images of your choice. And all these are all hyper-realistic image. When I mean hyper-realistic image, you can see on the screen, I'm on, on I'm on Pinterest. So you see on the screen, these are Pinterest. We're not using Pinterest. I'm just using this for an illustration. So you're going to learn how to create um, AI images of, you can generate any kind of image you think of. Uh, because of copyright advice, you use AI to generate your image. And secondly, you can carry your image and turn it to what you want with the app I'm going to show you. Then I'm going to make teach you how to turn your own picture to something like this. So you get your picture, you fine tune it to a realistic image like this, as you can see. So this is an image of mine that someone sent to me and I showed you and I changed it to this stuff. Then above all on this, so when I come straight to the videos, let me come straight to my file manager and show you something. So at the videos aspect, I'm going to show you how to do this as well. So let me play this. So I'm going to show you how to make all these in this video. So this video is going to be uh, A and B. So it's going to be part one and part two. So first of all, we have to ensure we have a good app, uh, good phone, because it's good you have a good phone. So now we'll go straight to Play Store first of all, because that is the first place we go to. The first app we will be using to generate images of a choice. Any image of your choice is called Lesico app. So we're going to come here, uh, Lesico hat. You're going to install this app like this because I've installed it just this little megabyte and you have it. So with Lesico app, you see you can generate stuff like this. But the benefit of it is that you can generate all kind of image you like. Then you can make the image talk. Definitely, you can make it talk. And currently, so if Hyper Image has been trending. People are generating a lot of image. I'm going to open it now. People are generating a lot of image for people. Collect eight pictures of them, 10 pictures, and change it to studio picture. So I'm going to show you in this video. So just stay tuned. So with the Lesico Hub, we have um, the interface like this. So you see how beautiful all this image is. It means you can come here and say, um, let's say um, something like philosopher. So you can come here and say ph philosopher. So I'm going to type philosopher and show you how data it on search. So just wait for this to search. It's going to generate. You see, we have all forms of philosopher on the screen. So you don't have to start looking for some stuff. These are beautiful philosophers. If you don't like them, you can come here and uh, click on generate. If you feel like generating an image that look like your own, you can come and describe your image and say, I need a boy with a red cap. Let's see if this comes up. Red cap and white shoe. So we can come here and say I need that and we have that. This is all this is totally free. We're going to eat on generate and we'll wait for that to just come up and we have learned a lot of image coming up soon. So just wait for this to read to the end and you have that all good. So now uh let's just wait almost generating and we're good to go and we can just use the images. All right so Oh, this is pretty, 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 pretty. This is very beautiful from the screen. So let me just go one step backward. You see, I made some uh, at this search here. I will not use the search. Instead, I'm going to generate instead of just searching. So let's see, right? Search for that. Okay, see, we'll have a boy on red shoe. We have different forms looking so, so beautiful. You can move on as well and eat on generate again. And go here and say a beautiful wedding gown. You can come here. I say beautiful wedding gown. So I'm going to hit on generate and just wait for this to generate and we are good to go. So a beautiful wedding gown is going to come up and we'll go there. So you can search for uh, Barack Obama. So let's just wait for this and we're going to search for Barack Obama. So you see all this beautiful gown, all this mermaid guys and all this stuff. So the final one you want to search is something like T Nupu. Let me search for obtainable though. That should be the president of Nigeria. So I'm going to search for that Tinubu and uh, instead of that, I'm going to eat on president. So let's just write president Tinubu from here. I'm not looking for trouble. I'm just trying to tell you something good. You can actually uh, go there and say president Tinubu. And so let's generate and just wait for this to come up. So anything you can think of, you can generate it in this place. So let's see if it comes up. If it doesn't comes up, we move on from this town hall to Ibala Blue. Anyway, that is... It's not coming up. That is not even an issue. So let's go one step backward before we round this up. So we can come here and say uh, president in the search area. We can say president Tinobo. 
you know, can eat on search. Then we can wait for this to come up. And we have something that looks like the town hall that is different from the Bala Blue. Anyway, I heard that somewhere that I'm just using the term. So we have someone that looks like the gangster and all this. So you can decide to curate something that looks like this and you're good to go. So if you want to search for, you can come here again as well and eat on uh, something like President. Good luck. Just write good luck. Jonathan that said there is God. The wife said there is God and we believe there is God. So now we just move on and see if it looks like Jonah Jonah. So if it doesn't look like Jonathan, we can just play on and just go on and on and on. All right. So just move on the screen and you see we're almost having apparent relate something that's related. I can never see someone that looked like the ex president of Nigeria, which is uh, uh, Buari. And we see some sauce and other stuffs. All right, so that is the beautiful Lexical app. One other thing we can do there is, if you like this, click on it, then you can download this by using the symbol here, which is called a download. So you can just click on that, and you've downloaded that. So this is how to play around, just generating. But this can turn your picture into AI. So at the end, I'll tell you what to do so that you can generate all lovely pictures you can see on the screen. As I've said before, I showed you in this source some AI pictures like this you can see. I'm going to show you how to do that. All right, so now we're done with this. We want to make some stylings to our picture. We want to do other stuff. Then we have to go back to that same Play Store and download the second app called Photo Lab. We're going to come here and say Photo Lab. So search for Photo Lab like this and open it. So I'm going to open Photo Lab immediately. Then with Photo Lab, you can style your picture and enjoy the benefit of styling. So you can tune your picture to all forms and all sorts. So from the screen here, you see we have this one here. If you open your own, it's going to look like this. So this is, uh, I'm using the premium. So trust me, if you need a premium, trust me. Chat me up. I'm going to tell you what to do. You're part of the premium plan. When they say premium, it means you can use everything about it all for free. Yes, that is a premium. So I've paid for it and I can use everything here without so just chat me up and i'll tell you what to do so from here now we have the first one here at the screen we have the feed here we have the top we have the trending we have the recent we have the search here we have the family we have the cartoon we have the background and all sorts and we have images on the screen so when i want to mimic this i'm going to click on this guy here now it's going to wait so from here i'm going to allow device because it's telling me to up so it means it's going to change your picture from this place to this so it means when you bring your image, it's going to turn into something like this. So what we'll do now is going to pick one from here and just try use it. So uh, from here now, let's find one of this picture and just click. So I'm going to click on this one. Yeah, that I have already this guy and see what it do for me. So click on it. Then I'm going to eat on the sign. So this sign is what we are going to click on. That look like arrow pointing to the right. So it's going to wait a bit. It's going to process this one slash two slash three. And we have these already generating so no time we should be done that's when the two we had a three and almost good so uh you can use pinterest for those guys who want to use pinterest you can use pinterest to download some image graphic designer video editors but if you want to work with image that are copyright free you can use your lexical hub for, as i've said here and generate pictures of your choice download it to your phone you can search for anything generate them then if you want to make some styling to it you can come straight to photo lab you see now this is me on call me what do you call me at daisy for those guys or you can call me at that wine anyway so you see how beautiful this guy is and this is a boy for crying out loud so that is one thing about photo lab is going to just tune your stuff and when you're good to go you want to save this to your phone all you have to do is to click on this sign there i believe that should I have to download to the save to device so i can click on save to device and i have that but we can try other stores because not just one feature is in this place this guy is sophisticated. So now from here now, if I'm searching for any picture that look like me at the faces, I'm going to just click on my face, which is the first one. It's going to bring all picture that talks about me. Then I can pick and pick and I'm good to go. But that is not what we are doing. So right now you can decide to uh, pick some template from here. I have numerous template I can work with. Numerous template I can work with. This, what it does for you is, tra is transform your image with Photolab. It transform your image to something you can see on the screen. Like if I pick this guy here now, this girl here, it's going to give me a sample. So it means it's going to turn this person from here to this. But this is, this is, let me be frank, this is only available for you when you're using the premium, the premium. So 
use the Play Store, use the free one and send me a DM. But ensure you like this video and show you subscribe. If you really want me to help you, then drop your best comment. Anyway, so now this guy, I'm going to pick this same picture and just wait for this and click on next. Or oh, once, just one step, I should have explained something. Over down at the down part of this, you can rotate, you can do other stuff you want to do here. So with this now, it means this one here means um uh, uh, portrait, which is nine ratio sixteen. This one is one ratio one. Why this one is 16 ratio 9? Uh, it means you can just tap on it and see what it do. It means it's going to resize, resize, readjust, and stuff like this. You can flip to uh, vertical and horizontal, top and bottom. You can rotate the image to your choice with the first one here. Then when you are good, hit on next, and we are good to go. Just wait for this in the classical time. We should have that. So this is this guy. Very funny. So it means you can generate any forms of image, even with the photo lab and all stuffs all stuffs all stuffs all stuffs all right now so um now we know what this another little thing i want to talk about is uh from here i'll talk about something different let me just go and step backward from here we have more you can decide to pick one of all these templates like this guy that is talking you can decide to animate your mouth but this is not the real hub i'm going to talk about that the real hub so we have this one too you can move around i believe there are lots and lots one can really use from here so you can generate this guy to something in that background trying to make some beautiful studio photos yes so you can pick your photo and generate studio photo and it become your see this guy here now so we have this it means you can bring this guy and a face you can take the guy's face to something from here to something like this anyway one more thing if, before we leave here and all right see you see all that stuff on the screen like this now it means you can generate your image to become something like this one year or something like this or something like this you can move on down again let's just keep on moving till we get other stuff done so you see we have a lot of beautiful stuff here till you get something that fits your taste then you can just pick some tune me this one here and you play around you move down to commando you meet out to all these asian warriors and they just play on you just keep on scrolling and you see this guy here you can pick it you can scroll down more there more and more templates here you can just pick and you're awesome and you you love them you really love them if you if you scroll so you can put your frame in and i think this is very very plenty very very plenty uh yes very very plenty so now at this place you can do some magic so you can come here and convert your stuff to other stuff you can just play around the screen you see you can add some effect at the star I'm clicking at the star and see what's on the star but there's nothing here i'm not starring anything i'm checking this place out so you can pick by hashtag and click on background so you're going to search for everything on the background if you have to click on background this is what i did i just click on this one here so i clicked on this one here sorry sorry for that so i'm going to move down i clicked on background and it brought everything about background with the hashtag so i'm going to play here if i want to talk about love I'm going to click on love. I'm talking about frames. I'm going to click on frames. So everything pertaining to frames will appear. Then I'll pick my image and frame it immediately and give to the guy to frame. So I'm going to click on this and frame it immediately. I believe this is the sample we are using today. That picture is very, very handsome picture. You know, I always talk about, I said, learn to love yourself. Very, very important. And please learn to learn. Sometimes some costs we are tell you to pay. If you don't have the money, no problem. But if you have the money and you think you want to pay, Pay and learn and go your way. What you know today, nobody will collect you. Trust me. This is not a motivation. This is reality. All right. So I've generated that without paying anyone. And I have some stuffs. All right. Now you'll be asking me, hey, all these tokens, make some restuff. Let's start animating them so that they can talk. Yes. So if you want the image to talk like this, I believe that's low storage. You want your image to talk like this guy. I'm going to talk about that in the next video. So I'm going to talk about how to generate realistic photo, how to convert this photo from the screen. You can see from here how to convert this to something like this. Because this one is some, is what I used to generate, a good resemblance. Then how to make it talk like this guy talking on the screen. And above all, I'm going to give you many, many things. I'm going to give you access to many digital courses. That will be on the part two of this course. So if you want to get the part two, all you have to do is drop your best comment what you like about it if you want the part to type part two then subscribe turn on the notification bell as well then you ensure you're part of the telegram team ensure you're part of the whatsapp team 
and ensure you participate fully well. Thank you for watching. Let me make the part two. Thank you.